Hi, welcome back to the YouTube channel. In this particular video, we'll see how to fix the Overwatch to disconnect it from the game server. So let's get started. The fix number one, check if the Overwatch 2 servers are down. Check the official forums like the Twitter or the downdetector.com to see if there is any kind of downtime or if there is any kind of temporary ad hoc maintenance is going on. In that case, you just need to wait for some time, then you can try again later. Okay, so here you can see if there is any kind of downtime is there, it's updated. Overwatch 2 outages reported in the last 24 hours. Okay, and here you can see the time also on which particular time there is a downtime or the maintenance is going on. Okay, so if the servers are down, the error is likely to be caused by the server side problem that you cannot fix on your end. You will have to wait for the blizzard to resolve the issue. Fix number two is restart your router and the gaming device. Unplug the power cable from your router and wait for the 15 to 30 seconds. Plug the power cable back in to the router and wait for it to fully power on. Turn off your gaming device. Wait for 30 to 60 seconds then turn your gaming device back on fix number three is change your dns settings open the network settings change click on the change adapter options right click on the active connection and select properties select internet protocol version 4 and click on the properties select use the following dns server address enter the preferred and alternate dns Click OK to save, run ipconfig slash plus DNS in the command prompt and restart the device. So once you go to the command prompt here you can type ipconfig slash plus DNS. Okay, and the fix number four is update your network drivers. Check if your network drivers are up to date using the Windows update. Go to the settings, update and security, Windows update, click and check for the updates. If any network drivers updates are available, install them. Okay, so what you can do is like you can just go to the settings. Once you go to the settings, update and security, Windows update. So once you go to the web Windows update here, you can check for the updates. If there is any kind of update is going on, you can update it. Okay. Suppose if there is no update is available, then what you can do is like you can just go to the device manager. Once you go to the device manager, right click on the network adapter and select the update driver. So here you can see and here you can click on the update driver. Okay, and the fifth fix is fix number is disable any proxy servers or the VPN open the control panel internet options connections tab LAN settings uncheck use a proxy server for your LAN click OK to save changes verify proxy or the VPN disabled by the visiting website if using a VPN disconnect or turn off the VPN client okay so that's all about this particular video guys i hope you like this particular video please do subscribe to the youtube channel see you and all thank you bye bye